the second day of which we arrived and literally got to the beach and you, it was all good, you know, like it looked really good. And then the set came through and there was just silence on the beach, you know, like everyone looking at each other and like, uh, the swells arrived now, you know, like it's on. You can see the slack in your line sort of starting and that's the problem with such a perfect long wave. You really need to like reposition yourself before your kite starts to drop and after that first section got my kite back into a good position and yeah you could just see this wave ready to start lining and reeling down. Second section got a bit deeper on it and I could just literally see my lines going up in this wave and I'm like, oh my God, I'm going to die, I'm gonna die. And then, you know, you make it out the second section, you're like, okay, hey, there's gotta be like one more section here. And the bottom section just gets heavier and heavier the further you go. And I was just watching my kite fall completely out of the sky and I was like, oh no. <laughs> I've never been so stoked in my life. Like that was the wave that I always wanted to get there. And yes, I want to get deeper and better than that, of course, but that was the taste of goodness. And it feels good to taste it, I'm not gonna lie. Was that Josh? Yeah. Yes, sir.